there, my name is Sarah Girdwood from CHRW, that's 94.9 FM, and today we're here at the Oxford Renaissance Festival in Woodstock. As you can see, there's a lot of action going on today, so join us as we check it out. So here we have Sir Timothy, who is a Obviously, gallant night at the Ren Fest today. Um, how long have you been jousting? I've been jousting for 13 years now with the Knights of Valor. For your corrupted intentions, your union shit starts. I'll dismiss you, foul sheriff, with this arrow through your heart. Oh, please, no, don't shoot me. To oh. <laughs> So here I am with Lickety, who okay. just um, performed. Um, could you tell us um, something about your professional career? My professional career? I don't know if I'd use those words. I do a, a half an hour comedy show here. It's called The Mud Show. Yeah. I do it three times a day at the Oxford Renaissance Festival. If you didn't come out and see it, it's your loss. It was an amazing, wonderful weekend. 88 miles an hour! 88 miles <laughs> Couple people. <laughs> mostly, mostly I do this just for that joke, so, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm a, a, I know it looks like I know what I'm doing, right, but I am really just a hair's breadth away from making a mistake, I've lit myself on fire doing this three different times, so, um, and I know when they tell you, they tell you in school, kids, they say if you light yourself on fire, stop, drop, and roll, right, we all heard that, stop, drop, and roll, I got news for you. You light yourself on fire, you will never remember stop, drop, and roll. <laughs> now, you light yourself on fire, pretty much all you remember is... Ah! 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 Here I have Zoltan the Adequate. Um, he just did a amazing magic comedy show and is going to show us a trick, if you right. will. I'm going to do something special. I don't do this during my show, Dara. I'm going to do it just for you and your okay. uh, listeners and viewers. This is a little unusual. I do a style of magic that's often referred to as sideshow or geek, okay. and it, uh, it involves things that other people wouldn't normally do. The classics of geek magic involve uh, fire eating, which I do. Uh, I swallowed a four-foot balloon on stage. If you had come out and seen that, well, you would have seen me do it. But I have something special just for you. Dara, my dear, I want you to take one of these... Uh, Sarah, I, I also, I inhale a lot of kerosene. Sarah, my dear, um, take one of these small plastic beads. Okay. Take a look at it, stare at it, memorize it. Good. Good. <laughs> All right. What I want you to do is I want you to place it gently on my tongue. Okay. <laughs> that was fun for me. Fun for you. Are you eating my beads? No? Okay. Here. Oh, I don't know if I want to. No. Oh, this is great. <laughs> and it comes out of his eyeball, there you go. ladies that, and gentlemen. Friend, that is geek, pure geek, right there. Yeah, that's a, that's a whole <laughs> lot of something. <laughs> CHOW at the very first Oxford Renaissance Festival. This summer, we are where you are. <laughs>